As you said, I mean, you don't go into any test match thinking you have to get 400, 500 runs. I mean, it's just a, how it pans out. But at this point of time, we've actually got to a phase, we've actually studied it and got to a situation where we could be a little, little comfortable. I won't say we, we're totally out of the woods. But if we get a few more runs in the morning, the morning session could be very crucial. If we get a few more runs, get past 353, 75, then I think it could be a real game on. It's got more bounce. Uh, I don't think you can really plunk your foot forward and keep defending. That's not going to be the case. Definitely more aid for the spinners and there's more bounce in the wicket. I thought it was a brilliant knock. Uh, the amount of times he trusted his defence and kept on defending the ball was just brilliant. Just uh, eased the nerves as I went into bat. He was just defending it beautifully. And I thought it was a very well-paced knock. If he, hadn't, if he hadn't got 100, it would have been a shame this particular day. We just batted. Uh, I, just, I just batted the way I know to bat. I've, I've always batted like this. So, like used my feet up and down and tried and varied the lengths to the bowlers of bowling. I thought Monty and Swan bowled really good spells when I went into bat. So that was the basic plan that I had in mind. I had I prepared quite well as to what I was going to do, come what may. So it's not about the balance or anything. We, we batted pretty well to get to where we have. There's a lot of work to be done. If we can get more runs, I think we'll put a lot of pressure on them.